Welcome to Wing Tech Corner. Um, today we're going to model a 100 by 100 millimeter PCB in Eagle. We're going to start with a new PCB board. Going to call it a. Uh, oh, guess we're going to reuse the 50 millimeter board name. Then we're going to set our grid size to 100 millimeters, and this will make it easy for us to snap to grid um, to create the outline of the board. Make sure that we're on the dimension layer and our width line width is zero. So you'll see that the line snaps very cleanly. Um, and what we're going to do is switch back to five millimeter grids. And I was going to use my M3 preformatted object, but I think for this one I'll use a hole. And I'll set the drill to 3.2 millimeters, which works really great for M3 screws. And I'm placing them at the 5 millimeter inset position. Now I'm going to use the uh, Eagle Arc tool, still using the 5 millimeter grid. And we're going to create those um, boundary corners. This will create a nice 5 millimeter uh, rounded corner. Delete the uh, segments, and there we go. Really nice 100 millimeter uh, board with uh, 5 millimeter uh, grid insets for the M3 holes, a 5 millimeter uh, radius um, rounded corner, and yeah, and you can use this to basically build out a board and send and uh, design a board and use this for. Um, any project where you would like to prevent any kind of sharp corners. And let me just add a little text placement here just to annotate. So, um, hope you've enjoyed this. It was a very quick um, run through of creating a rounded corner PCB with a hundred millimeter um, size, square size. And uh, please hit subscribe um, if you want to see more. I'm always interested in hearing what people would like to see, so feel free to message me or ping me in the comments. Thank you. Bye.